Hello! So, it's uh, from the last week, it's just been about the Samsung S9 and the thing is, we finally have the S9 Plus. Phone was launched this week. Uh, the S9, let me just tell you the pricing first. The S9, the smaller one uh, that has a screen size of 5.8 inch, uh, it's available in two variants. Both of them are available in two variants. You have 64 GB and 256 GB. The 64 GB for the S9, the price starts at 57,900. For the 256 GB, you pay 65,900 rupees. For the S9 Plus, uh, it's 64,900. For 64 GB and 256 GB variant, is priced at 72,900. So actually for, uh, I mean, more than double the storage, you're paying only 8,000 rupees, which is pretty good, I have to say, yeah. All right, so this is the box and let's just quickly unbox it and tell you more about it. So the phones, uh, they're available in three colors. You have midnight black, and this is the midnight black that I'll be showing you right now. Then there is like a purple, so that's another color for you. Some people like purple. And there's blue. Blue is nice. Black, evergreen. Black, evergreen. That's funny. All right, so what do you get? You get this, and you have a SIM tool eject over here. You get the soft cover as well, and quick start guide inside, right? And this is the beauty, the S9 Plus. So the design language is pretty much the same as to what we've seen last year. Last year, when the S9 Plus, uh, the S8 was launched, we were like thrilled with the design and the display. This year, you won't be disappointed, right? All right, so you get the adapter because you have to charge your phone and you can't charge it without the charging cable. So you have the cable as well. Uh, also, Samsung gives you this uh, USB connector, so you connect this and you put in a pen drive or something to transfer, you know, to your mobile or to transfer something from your mobile to your pen drive. So you can actually it comes in pretty handy a, a, a lot of times. So, and you do get these headphones. Well, you know, a lot of smartphones don't give you headphones. They do, and they're the same old, powered by, uh, tuned by AKG. Sound pretty good and the cable is also tangle free. I mean, it is tangled right now, but uh, it will become free very easily. So that's also pretty good. So that's it inside the box. Let me just jump uh, to the phone, right? The S9 Plus. So it has a 6.2 inch of a Quad HD Plus Super AMOLED display. The display is a little brighter than the S8 looks awesome right so no doubt about the display it is awesome it's great the colors are like punchy on your face man real detail the ui is amazing the s9 plus is powered by uh, it's actually running on android oreo and uh, with their own custom ui and it's neat it's clean just like last year s8 Powering this is the Exynos 9810. Of course, you know, uh, the variant that we get in India are powered by their own processor, the Exynos, but they're pretty good. And, uh, you know, I can like, tell you the performance is going to be good. Yeah, because S8, there was no complaint with the processor, the performance, and the processor is a little better now. So, of course, you will have no complaints whatsoever. Now let me just talk about the highlight because I really want to talk about that. The highlight of course is the camera and the S9 Plus you have two cameras. Uh, one is your telephoto and one is your wide angle. Both of them are 12 megapixel. And the fingerprint scanner uh, position has been, yeah, it's now just found the right spot. This is why it's supposed to be not next to the camera because yeah, every time I would just put my finger on the camera and it would get dirty and I would feel the picture quality is bad, but that's not the case. And the thing about the camera is that now it gives you something called dual, uh, you know, variable aperture. So in, earlier we would have a fixed aperture, right? Or maybe you could just vary it, you know, but it doesn't give you all that feel. Right here in this you have f1.5 to f2.4. So if you're a photographer, you know there's a lot that you can do with it when you have the control of the aperture. But in general, the picture quality has improved. You have optical image stabilization in all the cameras, including the front. And it's pretty good, the clarity, the details, the low light performance is also pretty good. I say this because I've uh, you know, 
during the launch we took a couple of shots as you can see and uh, it came out pretty well right there's also something called this slow super slow mo mode which lets you click those small videos at 960 frames per second as you can see amazing right also you can shoot at 240 frames per second and uh, that's also cool but 960 that's awesome you can do a lot better you can create chip and all that the other thing is called the ar emoji so you can create your own animated version it's similar to what we've already seen in the iphone so yeah similar thing so create your own ar emoji and uh, communicate with your friend in the animation way animated way i like my emoji because i think my ar emoji looks prettier than me so yeah Otherwise, if you buy them right now, there are lots of uh, cashback offers, discounts, and lots of data offers that are going on. They've tied up with Jio, Airtel, and Vodafone, so nobody's really left. So make use of that as well. Uh, and there are others offer all, other offers also. And uh, um, yeah, the battery, 3500 mAh battery, that should do the job. But right now, we're thrilled. It looks gorgeous. We would recommend buy a cover for it as soon as you can. Because quite fragile although it's uh it has gorilla glass fire protection but still i would recommend that it takes care of your water splashes also still ip68 certified that's also pretty neat and uh, that's it the camera is usb so we're going to be shooting a lot of videos a lot of pictures from it and uh, you can follow me on instagram i'll be uploading you know all the pictures that i take from this i'm going to be using this extensively this whole week yeah so that's it the s9 and the s9 plus are finally here better than the S8 but uh, the camera is the USB right but how does it all come together you know we'll tell you so keep watching Tech and you thank you